It's the Daily Comedy News with your host, Mark Pyers. Join us for breaking headlines and all kinds of comedy shenanigans. Brought to you by the Beatsy. This guy right here, man, I did a story on him already, but he's a scumbag and a half. Venezuelan migrant influencer who encouraged squatting complains from jail. He's victim of persecution. <laughs> Go back to your country, okay? We don't want you here. You go, you bring your really cool skills back to Venezuela. Go and you steal, pilfer, and squat there, you know? And then let them know that it's your house now. Uh, he illegally entered the U.S. and encouraged other migrants to squat and take over American homes. He's now complaining from behind bars that he's the victim of persecution and misses his freedom. Uh, Lionel Moreno, 27, spoke to the New York Post during a 30-minute televisit from inside Gallega County Jail in Chardon, Ohio, earlier this week. He was arrested near Columbus for failing to appear for required check-ins with officers. Already, he's illegal not doing things legally. But you know what, guys? We should just let him out with no cash bail, right? Moreno whined to the Post that he came to the U.S. because of persecution in my country. But he's supposedly facing the same treatment now. It's all misinformation in the media about me. They're defaming me. They're misrepresenting me in the news, Moreno said, insisting he's a good father. You know, like I squatted in that house. I left my kids there to go and squat in the next one. That one, I just went to go drop a deuce because I needed to squat one. But when I came back, my kids were happy. I had milk in the fridge. You know, I stole that from another house, brought it to them, put it in the fridge, you know. It was a little old, but we, we got through it. Uh, Moreno insisted, he's a good father though, guys. Good father when he did that one. I miss my entire life. I miss my freedom. Look at all this cash he's got in his hand. This scumbag, you guys know whose money that is? That's your money. That's my money right there. He's holding our money in his hands, you know? Oh, I can't wait to give you my taxes, you fucking asshole pieces of shit that run this country. Oh, so you could do this. Let's give him, look, he's got an AR in his hand. Came here illegally. He's holding an AR. He's holding probably, let's call that 10 grand in his hand right there. But you got vets on the street, homeless people on the street, American citizens need to go pound sand. I'm sorry, we care about Moreno more. Moreno gets all of the goods. We're gonna give him a house too. I'm sorry? Oh yeah, no, he's squatting in that house. I mean, we have to give him the house because we're weird in America. Look, you could earn something. You could go out and buy something. But I could take it and just put my crap into the toilet and be like, you weren't here. There was a toilet there. And so now it's my toilet. And also the rest of this 6,500 square foot house. You know, you left to go and pick up your kids at school. I'm sorry, you didn't lock up. You didn't set the alarm and the, the crowbar across the front door so I couldn't break in. That's on you. <laughs> I'm sorry, officers, can you take this stupid lady away who lived here 13 minutes ago before she went to the preschool to pick up her child? <laughs> but it's my house now. Finders keepers, you guys know the rules, you know? Wherever I drop a deuce, it becomes my house. Moreno, that's Moreno's rule. Anyway, guys, federal documents reviewed by the Post now suggest that he may be facing federal firearm charges because, you know, he went and bought an AR as an illegal with our money. And then he's, like, doing social media posts about how you, here, guys, this is how you squat. Look, check out, I saw this toilet. I was like, I gotta go. And then the parent, lady's not there. Now it's my house. I went first to the bathroom. Then I'm, so I took the house. You could do that here in America when you're Venezuelan and your name's Moreno. <laughs> I'm leaving persecution in Venezuela. <laughs> I came to America for my freedom. For your freedom, I meant. I meant to take all your freedoms because I don't know if you realize it, but your government's treating us better than you. The people that actually have lived here and earned and pay for all of this insanity. Treated like crap. Moreno. He's the guy. Moreno's the guy. I didn't cross the Rio Grande. I got on a plane. Biden flew me in. You know, 300000 a month, guys. Well, let's make it easier for him to come in illegally. Huh? Let's just give him cash and a house. Huh? Well, they need, we need the votes. His TikTok account, which racked up more than 500,000 followers for Moreno, scumbag over here. Five, you guys followed him? You guys followed scumbag McGee over here? Look at him. Invading a house in the United States. Guys, he's invading houses. That's a freedom that we all should be afforded. You should be able to go and steal an American citizen's house. Yeah, because you deserve it. You're from Venezuela. 
and, and we're responsible for their crappy country. And we'll just turn ours into a crappy country. I think that's a great idea. <laughs> how many million people are here that don't follow our rule of law right now? Is it? Joanne, can you let me know how many? <laughs> Joanne, perhaps you could stop the wheezing. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Guys, sometimes Joanne lets one out. Right when we're in the middle of a story. He had previously told his audience he planned to make a business out of invading abandoned houses. You know, imagine you get on TikTok and you're like, guys, I'm just taking over houses. All right, follow me if you want to see me take over the next house. Squatting, dropping the douche, leaving the kids there, you know, with an a old bottle of milk and OJ that smells like rancid. It's disgusting, but I'm a good father. Moreno. Moreno insisted that the person on his social media posts was just a character. Guys, I'm just, I'm just messing around, you know, like telling people to go and rob, steal, murder, maim, you know, squat. <laughs> this is a character. I'm just being Moreno, the funny guy. You guys don't know that. In Venezuela, I'm the funny guy called Moreno. They call me like, I'm a comic relief guy there in, in Venezuela doing this whole like, you should go and kill, murder, maim, and squat. Just a character named Moreno, you know? I have a sarcastic dark humor, he says. That's my job. It's his job, guys. I just told you. It's what he did in Venezuela. Leano Moreno is the opposite. Oh, so, okay, so you're a piece of garbage scumbag during your posts, and then you're like the son of God right afterwards, right? Do you wear the cross as well? And you just read the rosary all day long, Moreno? Because I don't think so. I'm pretty sure you're the same piece of garbage we saw. The character, uh, right? Anyway, guys, Moreno, look at that nog, you know? I like to make people's, fun of people's heads. I don't know why. It just seems to be funny to me. Please hit the like on the way out the door, leave a comment and share. I'm live at 9 a.m. and after 9 p.m., so join us. This is the Mark Inspire Show.